WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 2 p.m. Eastern Time on Tuesday. Two hours left to go in the trading day. We got markets in positive territory. Dow Jones up above 27,000. S&Ps above 3,000 right now. We got the S&Ps positive by 36 points, trading at 3,001. Dow Jones positive 283 points, trading 27,070. NASDAQ up 113 points, trading 8,162. Gold pulling back, gold negative $12.70, gold trading $14.84.90. Notes and bonds, we got a little bit of lower price and higher yield. The 10-year negative 14 ticks. 129.25, the 30 year negative, a full point and five ticks at 159.31. And the dollar index off 144 ticks at 98.308. We'll start things off and we're going to jump around to some charts of the banks. Goldman Sachs coming out with their earnings. Looked like a tough morning for Goldman, but man, oh man, we're up almost $7 from where we were at early in the day. Traded down to 199 on their earnings, now back up to 206.48. JP Morgan delivered for sure coming in with 30 billion dollars of revenue the estimate that's for the quarter 30 billion dollars for the quarter the estimate was only about 28.5 they had record earnings as well jp morgan up about 3.8 percent you also had citibank out there with their earnings city up 1.87 percent and wells fargo with their earnings as well quite a rebound for all of these from early in the day wells fargo now up 2.9 percent jumping back to the charts we'll go through the indices quickly here there's your Dow 30 above 27,000, and you see the acceleration from about 8:30 up until about 11 a.m. when I got off, the, got off the air with Tom. Kind of at session highs, we were just kind of hanging at these levels for the last about three hours of the trading day. Nasdaq 100 powering higher session highs as we speak, 79.67. There's the S&P 500, and again 11 a.m. We're up there pretty much where we're trading at right now, 3,001 in the S&Ps. There's crude oil, quite a drop to lower territory early this morning, down to 52.40, back up to an area of about 53.67. Crude now trading at 53.16. There's gold pulling back for most of the session. Gold actually reaching a low at 14.81, currently trading 14.84, and the euro trading at 11031 with a little bit of pound volatility out there on some Brexit hope. Stay tuned, folks. We've got a replay this hour. Dave White out today, but Tom O'Brien coming up live at 3 o'clock. Markets in positive territory. Stay tuned, folks. We'll be right back.